the count. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Everyone, welcome to Funny Side Up. I'm Lisa, your host. There's a special guest in the kitchen. It's Zoe. Hey. Hey, Zoe. Welcome back. Oh, thanks. Anyway, you voted for your favorite Halloween monster. Zoe, do you want to tell them who won? Vampires won. Who wants to suck my blood? <laughs> so let's learn a little bit more about a vampire, shall we? A vampire is actually a dead person. I didn't know you wrote notes like that. It's a show. <laughs> A vampire is actually a dead person who is reanimated, like a reanimated corpse, and they need to suck the blood of the living in order to keep on living, right? Keep on unliving. So let's talk about some famous vampires. Count Dracula. Spike from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Twilight. Twilight. Edward Cullen. Edward Cullen. Robert, Robert Pattinson. True Blood. They've got vampires. Mm -hmm. And Count Chocula. Hey. Oh, what are we gonna make? We are making bloody Brussels sprouts that are cooked on the stove, finished in the oven, and then doused in a pomegranate glaze. Let's just get started. Okay, so first step in making these bloody Brussels sprouts is the glaze with pomegranate juice, apple cider, and sugar. And we'll just reduce it so that it thickens and really looks like blood. Get yourself like a saucepan. And into it we will add two cups of pomegranate juice. Ooh, look at this magical potion. It's a half a cup of apple cider. Ooh. I'll let Zoe do the honors of adding a quarter cup of sugar. We'll light this up to medium heat. Give it a stir. First, turn your oven on to 400 degrees. Now you want to get a pound of Brussels sprouts, clean them, and then have them like this. I'm going to use my cast iron skillet so that I can brown the Brussels sprouts on the stove, then transfer them to the oven. If you didn't have a cast iron skillet, you could just do the whole thing on the stove. So we finished the bloody Brussels sprouts and we are sitting here with a vampire. Hey, e vampire! Hey, vampire! Hello, Lisan Zoe. I want to suck your blood. Anyway, we made for you bloody Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts cooked in blood, real blood. Ew. Why don't you give them a try? So, what do you think? <laughs> I'm alive! I want blood all the time! <laughs> I must say, the Brussels sprouts are cooked to perfection. The way that they are browned on one side, but tender and soft on the other. Well, thanks for coming on the show, vampire. You were great. Thank you. <laughs> well, that's the show for today, folks. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next week when I do a special Funny Side Up video where I ask you what you'd like to see more of on the show. Until then, keep watching, keep leaving comments, and I was probably...
looks so good.